Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Today, we're gonna be talking about the... Not the next upcoming banner, but the one after. This character is Zhao. Guys, Zhao is a must summon. Why? I'm gonna, buy, I'm gonna tell you guys, today's video content is gonna be about how good is Zhao, should you summon, and when is this character rate up banner. But first of all, Zhao is an Enemu user. He's one of the Adeptus for Liyue that's guarding over Liyue. If you guys haven't done the quest for Liyue, you won't know this character. But if you do, you probably have a good idea of who Zhao is. Anyways, how good is he? Well, he's a Spear user. He has excellent DPS as well as he was broken in the past. I don't know if he still is. But maybe he is, maybe he isn't. It's, he's probably patched though. Will he replace the look on the team? I don't think so. Just because of his different abilities and his elemental, you know, he's an ammo. I don't think he's gonna replace your pyro user, right? But he might replace him only for the reason of his damage per second. Anyways, I, can, I don't have the exact basic stats, but if you guys see on your screen, I saw some gameplay of it. Hopefully, it gives you a general idea. Anyway, what about his talents? What about his skills and his elemental burst? Well, I'm going to talk about that really quickly. His normal at auto attack, 6 rapid strikes, as well as a charged attack. His charged attack is really good because it goes along with his elemental burst. His elemental burst increases its attack range, as well as his damage, as well as his jumping ability. This is really good because his charged attack is going to do a lot of damage because of his jumping ability as well as his increased damage. So that's really good. His elemental skill is also pretty good. You get two charges of the bat instantly, which is awesome. It's going to do a lot of damage for you. His first constellation increases his elemental skill charge by one. You're going to have three if you have a dupe of them, which is really good. The second is Zhao's energy recharge is increased by 25% if he's not in the current character you're using, which is also pretty good. His fourth, the third is not very important. When his HP falls below 50%, he gains 100% defense bonus, which is incredible. And fifth is not so important as sixth. Hitting two or more enemies with a charge attack grants an additional elemental skill. Should you summon for him, would I recommend it? Yes, absolutely. If you have space on your team and you want to have two Enamel characters on your team, that's fine. Especially because of the um, elemental passive you get. If you have two Enamel characters on your team, you're going to have 20% decreased stamina usage for running as well as gliding, which is really good. Anyways, he's a strong unit that can deal lots of damage for your team. And it's just, he's just really good. I would definitely save my Primo Gems to summon for him. Anyways, is he going to be on the next character rate of banner? Probably not. Having rapid succession of animal character users is going to, is not good. So he's probably going to be on the one after Zhongli. Zhongli's probably going to be the next character to be rated up. And I highly recommend you take a good gander at which one you want to summon. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did, hit the like button as well as subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.